Hey everyone and welcome back to another video. So this is the first video on my new Fire Max 11 tablet. We're going to be doing a stress test. Okay, so for you guys that took about two seconds. Uh, but for loading so far, this is uh, so far so good. Not bad. Obviously, I can, I can definitely tell this runs better than my 10th generation HD8 Fire tablet. So, uh, give me a moment to change the settings back to default. Alright, so we're back. So these are the default settings that the game had when I first downloaded it. Um, everything on at 7 chunks. And... So far, that's actually not too bad. Uh, I'm not sure how well this shows up on video, but right now... We're getting about... It looks like about 20 to 40 FPS, but it's uh, it's definitely unstable. If uh, if you stand still, um, you'll probably get about 40 FPS, maybe even 50. All right, so we're now on 12 chunks of render distance. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh oh, it's holding. Yeah, it's holding. A little lag there, but yeah. This is actually doing surprisingly well. Yeah. It seems to be holding 30. Obviously, I have no FPS counter. But um, from what I'm used to just trying to tell from what I can see, it looks like maybe about 30, 40 FPS right now. Oh, let's uh, do the old classic TNT test. I will do slash fill once I uh, get a sufficient amount here. So... So first, let's start with a 3x3 three three of TNT. Oh, yeah. Well, already there's a little frame drop. I did notice some lag there, but other than that, no issue. All right. So now we have a 5x5 five five of TNT here. I was going to do something like with shaders and high texture packs like I did with my last tablet, but I just decided not to go through all the trouble. Okay, so definitely for TNT wise, performance not good. If I had this on the lowest graphics settings and then tried TNT, it'd probably work a lot better. If you're gonna play on a Fire Max 11, settings I would probably recommend is keep all the other settings on unless if you have preferences, uh, but definitely keep the simulation distance as low as you can in the world's making settings. And then for render distance, I'd recommend staying at either 6 or 8 or 7 in between. Yes, it does run at a playable, definitely playable, and decently stable frame rate on highest uh, maximum settings in-game, that is, without mods. It can be a little unstable, especially if you're recording, so obviously this would probably run a teensy bit better. It doesn't do too much of a difference to be noticeable. Basically it for the stress test of Minecraft on the Firemax 11.